Loving and forgiving are you, O Lord. Slow to anger, rich in kindness, loving and forgiving are you. Almighty King, bless the Lord, bless the holy name of God. Almighty King, bless the Lord, remembering the goodness of God. Loving and forgiving are you, O Lord. Slow to anger, rich in kindness, loving and forgiving are you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Amen. the peace and grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you always. And with your spirit. We pause now to ask God's mercy. You were sent to heal the contrite. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. You came to call sinners. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. You plead for us at the right hand of the Father. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Amen. Let us pray. Rejoicing in this annual celebration of our Lenten observance, we pray, O Lord, that with our hearts set on the Paschal Mysteries, we may be gladdened by their full effects through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. A reading from the book of the prophet Hosea. Come, let us return to the Lord. It is he who has rent, but he will heal us. He has struck us, but he will bind our wounds. He will revive us after two days. On the third day, he will raise us up to live in his presence. Let us know, let us strive to know the Lord. As certain as the dawn is he coming, and his judgment shines forth like the light of day. He will come to us like the rain, like spring rain that, that water, waters the earth. What can I do with you, Ephraim? What can I do with you, Judah? Your piety is like a morning cloud, like the dew that early passes away. For this reason, I smote them through the prophets. I slew them by the words of my mouth. For it is love that I desire, not sacrifice, and knowledge of God rather than burnt offerings. The word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be God. God. It is mercy I desire, not sacrifice. It is mercy I desire, not sacrifice. Have mercy on me, O God, in your goodness. In the greatness of your compassion, wipe out my offense. Thoroughly wash me from my guilt, and of my sin cleanse me. It is, it is mercy, mercy I desire, and not sacrifice. sacrifice. For you are not pleased with sacrifices. Should I offer a burnt offering, you would not accept it. My sacrifice, O God, is a contrite spirit, a heart contrite and humble. O God, you will not spurn. It is mercy I desire and not sacrifice. Be bountiful, O Lord, to Zion in your kindness by rebuilding the walls of Jerusalem. Then shall you be pleased with two sacrifices, burnt offerings and holocausts. It is, it is mercy, mercy I desire and not sacrifice. sacrifice. <clears throat> Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ, King of endless glory. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ, King of endless glory. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Jesus addressed this parable 
to those who were convinced of their own righteousness and despised everyone else. Two people went up to the temple area to pray. One was a Pharisee and the other was a tax collector. The Pharisee took up his position and spoke this prayer to himself. O oh God, I thank you that I am not like the rest of humanity, greedy, dishonest, adulterous, or even like this tax collector. I fast twice a week, and I pay tithes on my whole income. But the tax collector stood off at a distance and would not even raise his eyes to heaven, but beat his breast and prayed, O oh God, be merciful to me, a sinner. I tell you, the latter went home justified, not the former. For everyone who exalts himself will be humbled, and the one who humbles himself will be exalted. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. From this Gospel uh, of the humble tax collector who recognizes his sinfulness before God and seeks God's mercy comes a most ancient of prayers in the Eastern Church that is prayed on beads, prayer beads, called, we call it the Jesus Prayer. And the words said on each prayer are, Lord Jesus Christ, have mercy on me, a sinner. And that is repeated continuously throughout the prayer. It's probably more ancient even than our prayer of the rosary. And it has been prayed by those who are meditating all the time on their prayer beads, but recognizing and calling out to Jesus to recognize that they are sinners and dependent upon God's mercy. And indeed, we are all sinners and dependent upon God's mercy. So let us daily recall that God's mercy is great and that no matter what our sin, his mercy is greater. Let us stand to pray. Grateful for the many blessings the Lord has bestowed upon us, we present him with our prayers. For the church throughout the world, may the Holy Spirit lead us in lives of charity and union with God. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. For all nations and peoples, may God open their hearts to the gospel message. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. For all who are facing difficulty or hardship in their lives, May the peace of Christ that is beyond all understanding bring them comfort. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. For the elect preparing for baptism, may the Lord continue to nurture in them the hunger that only he can satisfy. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. For those who have died, may they know the embrace of the risen Lord this day most especially we pray for Ginny Lewis. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. prayer. For what else shall we pray? Have mercy on the people of Ukraine to bring peace there and to our own country, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, our hear our prayer. For the repose of my, the soul of my uncle, uh, David, who died yesterday, and for his uh, son and daughter and their children, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. prayer. Almighty and ever-living God, we ask that you hear our prayers and grant them in your mercy through Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, 
fruit of the earth, the work of human hands, it will become for us the bread of life. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine, the work of human hands. It will become for us our spiritual drink. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours will be acceptable to God, the Father Almighty. May, May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. O oh God, whose grace it comes, by whose grace it comes to pass that we may approach your mysteries with minds made pure, grant, we pray, that in reverently handing them on, we may offer you fitting homage through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. With your spirit. Lift up your hearts. Lift Lift up up the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is, right and just. it is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through your beloved Son, Jesus the Christ. For by your gracious gift each year, your faithful await the sacred Paschal feasts with joy of minds be pure, so that more eagerly intent on prayer and on works of charity and participating in the mysteries by which they have been reborn, they may be led to the fullness of grace that you bestow on your sons and daughters. And so with angels and archangels, with thrones and dominions, and with all the hosts and powers of heaven, we sing the hymn of your glory, as without end we acclaim. Holy, 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 Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord the font of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, and giving you thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving you thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith we proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly, we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, William, our Bishop, and all the men and women who serve the church. 
Remember also our sisters and brothers who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy, especially Ginny, remembered at this Mass. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse, with the blessed apostles, and with all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. For through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Amen. In confidence, we pray now in the words our Savior taught. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, for the, kingdom the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I leave with you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant us peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. 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 The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Spirit. Let us offer each other a sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those who are called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Let us pray. May we truly revere, O merciful God, these holy gifts by which you ceaselessly nourish us, 
and may we always partake of them with abundant faith in our heart through Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 The Lord be with you. And with and with you. you. Uh, let us bow our heads to pray for God's blessing. Hold out to your faithful people, Lord, the right hand of heavenly assistance, that they may seek you with all their heart and merit the granting of what they ask through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. And may Almighty God bless us, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Our Mass is ended. Let us go in peace. Thanks. 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 We'll sing the refrain of our hymn. Loving and forgiving are you, O Lord. Slow to anger, rich in kindness. Loving and forgiving are you. Have a good day, all. You too, Father. Enjoy your day.